Hello friends, welcome to the new video of React Native. So today we are going to integrate the React Native maps in React Native. So whenever we have a requirement regarding the map, so we always use React Native maps. So you can see that we have almost everything over here. Like you can see that uh, this maps, if draggable map you want, map view event, this map tracking location, this is also there. This is also the programmatically changing the region. So this, this type of maps that you can create using this React Native map functionality, okay? So we are going to, uh, I'm going to add some custom React map view only and the marker. So basically I'm going to use this both parts. Map view basically shows the map and marker that you can draggable, that where you can drag from here and to there. So these components I'm going to use over here. So bef uh, before those who haven't subscribed my channel, please do subscribe my channel and hit like to this video. So copy this React Native uh, maps. You need to install this package first. So I have already installed. After the installation, just make a build, okay? Or you can modify the app.js. So uh, where is my app.js? So I have basically used the map view and the mark marker draggable, okay? And nothing else. So I have used this one. And after doing this, you need to add in Android.manifest API key because without the API key, you can't proceed further right so where you have to add this api key i will let you know so first of all go to the your folder android app source main android manifest.xml and open it and here you need to add your metadata with a google api key and this is your key actually this key is basically not working my, my site because uh, because the google api key is basically payable or billable right so i need to create that account and need the credit card debit card details so i'm not doing that much process so you need to generate the api key first because you have to choose android maps uh, sdk sdk for android maps you need to select from the uh, whenever you try to create a project for the api key you need to go with that and after this after getting the api key you need to just put it over here okay then map view will be showing up and now you can see that if i go and see that here just give me a second what happened so it's connecting so you can see that only google part is coming you can see that google map uh, map is not because the, the api key is wrong so when you create that you, the map will be showing you on that okay so on that note any query any issue in that just let me know in the comment section thank you so much for watching this video have a great day so you can use this react net max uh, maps and any query let me know in the comment section okay thank you so much for watching this video have a great day